Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to create a deep fake of anyone using a machine learning model in Python. In case if you don't know what a deep fake is, it's basically swapping a face of someone in a video with someone else to make it look like that person is inside that video and which is basically a technology which is used for face swapping and it has become very realistic as you're about to see. So we'll be using the first order model uh, trained and created by Alexander Siarohin. So this is the GitHub repository. I'll be giving the link to this and everything in the description. So don't worry about that. So you can check the project files, how it was trained and everything. And basically everything is explained in the readme file. And the data set and everything is given. So I will not be going deeper into the code, but I'll just explain how it's working and how you can run it to create your own deep fake of anyone. Okay. So this is the Google Collab link. Again, I'll be giving this in the description from where you can create your own deep fakes. So first you need to add this folder to your Google Drive and this folder will have basically all the pictures, pictures of the person you want to swap and the video in which you want to swap. So you can see that this folder is shared with you. This folder is shared with me in my Google Drive first order motion model. But you need to have this folder inside your Google Drive. So this is just a shared folder. Look, you can see here, I have the first order motion model and this is inside my Google Drive. So what you need to do is just go to your Google Drive, create a new folder with this name, first order motion model. And from here, just select all the files and make a copy. And then you can move those files to your folder. And thus you'll have this folder, first order motion model with everything which you need to do. And you can even add your own images to create your own personal deepfakes. Okay. Now, once you have that, we can start to running the code. First thing you need to do is you need to clone the GitHub repository, which has all the project files. So you can just run this. Okay, so I've already done this and now we'll go to that directory. Okay, and then we need to mount our Google Drive on the Colab. So we'll just run this again. So what we need to do is we need to go to this URL in a browser and then we need to enter our authorization code okay so I'll just do that I'll just go to this URL and it's asking me to sign in so I'll just sign in yeah so just a little bit of verification Okay. And after you're done with the sign in, you'll be given that code. So allow. Yeah, so this is your code basically. All you have to do is just copy and just paste it here. Okay. And that's it. Just press enter. And after this, your drive is mounted. Now, this is the important part you're loading the driving video and source image okay so you can see that the source image is 02.png and in here 02.png is of Vladimir Putin and if you name if you give any other image in 02.png then that will be the one swapped okay now what are we swapping it with we're swapping it with 04.mp4 and 04.mp4 is a video of Donald Trump and again, if you have a different video, then you can swap. So basically, if you have 02.png with something, uh, if you replace it with some other picture, and if you replace this video with some other video, then you can do that. Okay. So you can just run this again, and it'll take a little bit of time to run because it's working. So you can see that it's being run line by line. So this is the video of Donald Trump and this is Vladimir Putin. So we'll be making the deep fake of Putin. So it'll look like that Putin is the one saying in the video. Okay, so let's get to the next part. So in this we have to create and load checkpoints. Okay, so this is the file voxcpk.pth.tr. With this we'll be having the checkpoint. Okay, 
so this is completed and now we have to create and perform the image animation so from Vladimir Putin from Donald Trump to Vladimir Putin so you can see that it will be displayed in our own browser the source image the driving video and the prediction and then you can see that the video can be downloaded from the content folder and this is it so this is where the magic happens so we had Donald Trump saying something and we added a picture of Vladimir Putin and now it's Vladimir Putin saying the same thing but like I said you don't need to limit yourself to this you can create any picture and with that you can create that deep fake so I'll just show you that so suppose I want Shrek to say something that Donald Trump was saying that so I'll just delete this and what I'll have is I'll have Shrek as 0 to PNG okay so I have Shrek and rename it to what 0 to dot PNG and now you'll see that it'll be the Shrek saying the Donald Trump speech okay so we'll be needing to run these things again because you're again like changing the image and now you'll see a picture of Shrek with the video of Donald Trump okay and again we'll have to run this model and load checkpoints yeah. done and then we have to perform the final image animation so this is basically where the magic happens okay so here we go now you can see that it's Shrek saying what Donald Trump was saying but you can see that it's not really perfect because the image of Shrek is a little different than Donald Trump so if we use a human then it will be better because you know humans will have the same features and like Shrek who has this weird ears so like this you can create any picture and you can have any video and you can create a deep fake by swapping the face of that person in the video with the face of the person in the image so that's it and finally if you want to download you can just download it from the content folder from here so that's it I'll give a link to everything in the description so that's it thank you for watching